Here's a little tutorial on how to record with a microphone. So I'm going to add a track and then I'm going to choose voice and microphones. Uh, the default setting if you have a computer uh, built in um, microphone or if you have uh, plugged in a microphone into your computer will come up. You can change this uh, if you like and change any of these and then save your setting. Uh, if you like, you can just try them out and see what you think. Uh, sometimes what happens is that, uh, I'll choose this setting, you get some reverb built in. I recommend that you take that out. You can always add reverb after the fact. So the other thing you'll need to do is whatever microphone you have chosen, uh, you can cho choose that here or change your microphone. I'm using a headset mic right now. And what you want to do is check your volume check. So uh, I'll show you that again. Go right down here to this little cogwheel and you will check your volume. And what this will do is uh, you'll speak normally and it will basically be the automatic gain. That's the volume input for your microphone. And it'll put a uh, limiter on it so you won't overload. So this is all automated here. I'm going to start the test. Two, two, one, two, check, check, two. Hey, this is me testing. Yeah. Now you can reset this if you don't like it or whatever, you can go back and do it, but let's take a listen. So it set an automatic lim limiter. I'll start recording. Test, test, one, two, ha, check, one, two, test. So, so I'll, I'll play, play it back. back. Um, let's see, let's record enable. I'll take that off if I don't want to hear my microphone. microphone that's, that's that, that noise, noise in the back. Um, so here we are. Test, test, one, two, ha, check, one, two, test. So there's an automatic limiter in there. You should not overload. Uh, but when you go to test your microphone, test it kind of loud. So it gives you some good gain control and a preset there. And that's how it works in Soundtrap.